Hi boys and girls, today we're going to make a tier list. So, let's start off with Meowth. I would put it in D for decent. Up dash. I'm going to put it in C. For her friends, uh, same as me, Elf. Reasoning the uh, B. Because I like it. Because I like it. Because it helped gather in the time of need well when it's when a, a lot of poisonous gas was around so that's why I like it now let's see about Mr. Mime or uh -huh, Mr. Mime I'm not yelling <sighs> so which, where do I put Mr. Mime E K uh Costa Decent Pokemon it can be tanky six seconds uh I have not used it yet including with a mark line in A tier because it's a very good Pokemon and its evolution is even better. Stunfish or Earth. Actually, yeah, I never used it. Uh, yes, I'll put it in F tier. Gookie. I've not used it yet. Go and put in it in for not used yet tier. Score bunny line. Pretty decent. Put score bunny and beat here. Then wrap it in. No. Beat here. Score bunny is in. B tier, then Cinderace, S tier. Sobble, mm. pretty good. Look fun, as seen. Also goes with D tier. In battle on YouTube. Ripple, yeah, I think I will beat. And tell you why not I just move all the Google line up. To starters, where the starters are at. Squirrel vet, uh, no, not very good. Greeted, C tier. Rookity, C tier. Go for it. Mm. Go for A tier, then go night A. Definitely S tier. <laughs> but bug, uh, weak. It becomes stronger. Boost it this one up to D tier. For Dr. Norbeetle. A tier. I use Naked and Feeble. Feeble. Before, so I'm going. Nick is pretty decent for Pokemon because it's a very dark type. It helps with uh, with speed, psychic type. So it's pretty useful, I would say. And. 
and free fall, C tier, uh, Glossifer, uh, E tier, uh, and going into Ralph Lauren, Lulu, I like it, B tier, Double, and not used it yet, but it seems pretty tanky, so T tier for defensive strategies. Lulu, I like it because copycat. Dreadnought, well, Trudel and Dreadnought, B for Trudel and a for trade though. I say D tier for Yamper and C for Tux for Bout Town or Koi. I will go with C tier for what Kari, Kaiko B tier, but Colossal S tier, no A tier because it's such a good Pokemon because he crash and matches on raids, so Rayward can easily overpower it or any heavier Pokemon that's heavier. And Colossal. Apple Win. Uh, I have not used this one yet. Or Apple. I use Apple Ton. Uh, 80. Pretty decent. Santa Conda. Seat here after you fight the uh, the glass, water, and fire gems. Santa Granda is a early ground type, so that's why I say it's pretty good because it handles any gym. Like if you're playing so, if you're like for example, if you're playing. So you have to face the rock type gym, which you can easily see. Sweep of Santa Conda. But shield uh no, that gets debuffed because Ice type gym is the rock type gym. So that's why I'm putting it in both of them in C tier. Hammer? Dive? We're good, easy. Because when it dies, it gets a fish. Then when it's attacked, it shoots out the fish. And sometimes gets gets a Pikachu. And once it gets hit, it spits out a Pikachu and some and some paralyze it. Paralyze the Pokemon sometimes. Which is OP uh, F tier weak. Draw for E tier Toxel. Not very good. F tier because if it has removed that transforms it into the into the yellow if into this form right here. It it does not even gets a level up mode move until it evolves and it gets all level up moves. And this one? Uh, I'm sorry I put it in F tier. Mm, Toxicity, it's a good B tier. I have not used this one yet, but I would say even better than Toxicity. Because it runs even more moves than toxicity. B, uh, weak fire bug type E. But I can easily sweep 
glass, which is glass gym because four times she'll perfect it, four times she'll eat this. Because glass does not do that much to fireball types. And then fall form, uh, I can easily say for ice type gym is the rain shield. Panda, very good. D tier. This dude, uh, pretty decent. Grab, uh, also that one. Thirsty, hmm, I've not used it yet. What about this? I have not even used the, this Pokemon before. Ever. This one, I don't know. Why, but I feel like I want. I actually never used this. Going for whole wine. This, uh, this is a different story. Honestly, Chain Tears, right, D tier. This one, but, Berserk, uh, I never used it before. Oh, my brother has, same thing as it's, this, same thing as it's pre-evolution. Pretty tanky. Five hats is fall form. Almost all the time I get critical hits. So B tier. Mr. Lime. Well, I have not used it yet. Mm, this one is pretty decent. Even though it, you have to catch your first in the before the ghost type gym, which, which is a ghost ground, and it's a ghost ground type gym, which can easily escape the ghost type gym. But if you find sword, there are fighting type gym, so you have to look for a different Pokemon. To evolve it, you have to get past the ghost and fairy type gym, then you can go to the wild, go to the different wild area, which is, actually, after you defeat the grass, fire, grass, water, and fire gyms, you have, you have to back, you have to go back to the area to well your mask and go into a certain type of bridge a stone kind of like a stone hedge bridge which is this one stone hedge little story mm. I like how it has different evolutions in showed a creamy this pretty Decent phalanx. Then it's just a failure. Some super cute D tier. Oh, whoops. Rock. Put it in the tier above. See. So hard. I have not even used that. This I have used. And I going to put it in D tier. As it's not even evolution when it has when it gets hail. I sure is D tier because it can take it. it do you know? I feel like I'm like a actually boost it up into C tier. This tier is this game big. This, uh, I feel like I wanna go for D tier Dene. Hit and 
Pecco? That's a wholly different story. B tier. Carpenter. Pretty decent Pokemon. So it's the wrong form. These are just a whole mess. So for this one, this one. Here for this one. Yep. That one. Cause you can't, you can't even see the normal forms. No, no, no. D. Ghost. Can we use the shape of ghost type gem? Smith. Let's go up. No, S. Put that up into S tier. This. Yes, and this one, but all the legendaries are the best part. Best part. Going this one. No, I just put these two into its into S tier. I can't even fit all of it into one hole. And uh, I feel like Mr. Ron should go with Mr. Mime. Where's Mr. Mime even? Oh, I kind of forgot. Uh, do you remember where, where I even put Mr. Mime? Oh, E tier. Then... Where did the first evolve? This... Obstagoon here. Obstagoon. Then. This is a pretty decent line, I would say. 80. Applin. Same thing. Okay. Then. This. Same C tier. Then this. Okay. I can't believe I seen the dark type that's pink. It's pink. I'm going to get rid of this one. There we go. Four tiers. I came up with. So, take a look at it. S tier, Skull Bunny and Talion with Boom, Call of the Night. I actually kind of forgot some of the names of these Pokemon. A, B, C, D, E, F. F is a complete failure because Songfish literally is a complete failure. I'm going to scroll the bit bug. There's Gouda, I think it's called. And Toxel. What a trash if it's if it's root is not white. Um what's we that? Not very good at all. Well grandmine uh, not even good. I actually never tried from bef tried from out before, but it just looks so gross. Except for the first one, I like it.
<laughs> it's cute. It goes pink. And also a lot of pelvis. So, that's the end of this video. Bye, boys and girls. See you right the next time. I'm going to make another video. Bye. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Bye.